Jason, do you know what time it is? It's time to figure out what's wrong with this Cadillac. Because the ignition does not work properly. Who was that? I'll bet it's Harco. I was wrong. It's my wife. We're just figuring out what we got to figure out. I don't know what I'm doing. Good. Neither do I. What? We're getting closer. To the ignition. If you're ever having an issue getting this thing out, then right here, it's a screw. It unscrews. Ta da! Dummies. I told you. <laughs> I'm gonna need a steering wheel puller, probably a longer screwdriver. Definitely gonna need the key. Why don't you just pull the steering wheel off? See? Oh, oh. never mind. I got this. <laughs> so close. Keep trying. <laughs> Guess we'll have to go to the toolbox. So that's a tooth puller. Yeah, that's how you. We do all our dentistry work in Diner Hush Garage. I heard it also <laughs> works good as a steering wheel puller. Yeah, it works for that too. But... As you can see, the steering wheel came off very quickly with that cool little cool tool, cool cut. Is that right? Hey, do me a favor, <laughs> rewind your video and see if the steering wheel is something like that or like that. Go to that, don't listen to the worst the piece of the you never know you're it's much more spacious in here now. We're just loosening two bolts that hold the bracket to relieve some pressure on some wires so we can pull the innards out. or something. It's when you have an idea.
So the only issue we had was the horn contact insulator was very brittle and ended up in pieces. So to uh, fix that problem, what did we do? Uh, we removed the horn relay so that it doesn't make any noise until one can be ordered. All right then, moment of truth. <laughs> 